In today's wrap-up, 79 new cases of COVID-19 have been confirmed. Former Prime Minister Garen Garapetian has appeared at the inquiry into the 2016 April war. An Armenian church has been attacked in Istanbul. And the National Assembly has moved to ratify the Convention Against Child Sexual Abuse. 79 more cases of COVID-19 have been confirmed in Armenia, raising the total number of cases to 3,392. This is a significant decrease compared to previous days. 34 more recoveries were reported and one more death. Four new cases have also been confirmed in Nagorno-Karabakh. And Health Minister Arsen Torosyan visited patients with coronavirus in hospital. He was wearing a hazmat suit. Former Prime Minister Garen Garabetyan has appeared at Parliament to attend an inquiry into the 2016 April War. The April War was an escalation of fighting in Nagorno-Karabakh that was the biggest escalation in fighting since the Armenian-Azerbaijani War of the early 90s. Garabetyan has largely retreated from the public eye after the 2018 Armenian Revolution that saw his eventual resignation and replacement with current PM Nikol Pashinyan. He jokingly remarked to reporters that he had missed them too. Garapetian recently appeared at the trial of jailed former president Robert Kocharyan and pushed the court to allow his release. Garapetian answered reporters' questions after the inquiry, stating that he has no intention to re-enter the political arena. He also said that Robert Kocharyan's trial has been politicized. Turkish Armenian newspaper Argos has reported that an Armenian church has been attacked in Istanbul. According to Argos, a man was trying to commit arson. Moreover, Armenian church leaders in Turkey have stated that the authorities have been notified and a man has been arrested and an investigation is being launched. The National Assembly has moved to ratify a Council of Europe Convention Against Child Sexual Abuse. 79 voted for the bill, with 12 votes against. The convention has so far been signed by 47 member states of the Council of Europe and has entered into force in 45 countries. Armenia signed the convention back in 2010. The convention is an international instrument to prevent child sexual exploitation, conduct investigations, raise awareness and protect victims. Armenia has now committed to adopt legislative, educational and organisational measures as well. Some opposition members had reservations, such as Vice President of the National Assembly, Vahe M. Fiajian, and opposition MP, Gevork Petrosyan, who said the convention is not in Armenia's best interest and is also opposed by the church. And finally, Sivonet's team went to the village of Arevik in the region of Shirak. This village is interestingly a majority Catholic village and not apostolic, with many being descendants of Armenian Catholics who fled from Constantinople in Turkey. Sivonet spoke to residents to understand the culture, differences and history of this Armenian Catholic community in northern Armenia.